here pass necessary journal entries at the time of admission of a new partner c the assets and liabilities of a and b were evaluated as follows hence if uh, in this question 55 we will prepare a revaluation account it will be better in the working notes it will be better to pass journal entries first answer 55 working notes revaluation account just minimal format a provision for doubtful debt at the rate of 10 percent was to be made on sundry debtors of rupees 50000 increase in liability to provision on sundry debtors is to be made at 10 percent and creditors were written back by 5000 decrease in liability a income for the firm by creditors 5000 b part then building appreciated by 40000 c part by building appreciated by 20% book value of building is 2 lakh 2 lakhs 20% is equal to 40000 by building 40000 unrecorded investments were worth rupees 15000 now it will be recorded by investments 15000 increase in asset a provision for 2000 was made on outstanding bill for repairs increase in liability to outstanding repairs bill to out provision for doubtful debts 5000 first adjustment increase in liability and the adjustment number 5 a provision of 5000 was made for an outstanding bill for repairs to outstanding repairs rupees 5000 sorry to outstanding bill for repairs 2000 and a part unrecorded liability towards supplier 3000 increase in liability to suppliers or creditors rupees 3000 now credit side is higher than the debit side total the credit side write it in the debit side find out the gap 50000 to capital accounts revaluation profit there is no ratio it will be distributed equally among a and b that is a is equal to b is equal to it will be like uh, a is equal to 50000 multiplied by half there is no ratio given half half that is rupees 25000 for a for b it will be rupees 50000 multiplied by half that is rupees 25000 now the total amount is 50000 this is the answer of revaluation account we can have three entries for the credit side creditors account debited building account debited investment account debited to revaluation 60000 one entry second is revaluation account debited to provision for debts 5000 to provision for outstanding bill for repairs 2000 to creditors 3000 this is 10000 rupees revaluation account debited to all these three then last entry will be revaluation account debited to s capital b capital 20 to 25000 each once you prepare this revaluation account the entry is visible to you very clearly next you can proceed to the next step fair notes draw proper format of a journal then you have to start with first entry in the debit side revaluation account debited 10000 to provision for doubtful debts 5000 to provision for outstanding bill repairs bill 3000 to creditors 2000 being increase in the value of liabilities transferred to revaluation account in the credit side we have three things that is second entry creditors account debited 5000 building account debited 40000 investments account debited 15000 to revaluation account 60000 being increase in the value of assets and decrease in the value of creditors credited to revaluation account then third part is yours revaluation account debited 50000 to a capital account 25000 to b capital account 25000 being profit on revaluation transfer to partners capital accounts in old ratio now debit credit both are to be totaled and that is rupees 120000 each first one is the debit side items second one is credit side third one is the debit side items for profit now the totaling is done and this is the final answer